I'm, uh, they, you know, my, I have a radio name too, by the way. Well, let me hear your radio name. Yeah. Sweet Lee from the Sioux, actually. All right, say it again. Does anybody know where Sioux St. Marie, Ontario, or Michigan is? Raise your hand. Of course we all do. I talk, you know, I'll, I'll tell you why. We've got quite a few listeners there. Actually, I'm here because I heard you in Syria, so it's great. Is that the way to come from? I was born in Italy. Buona sera, tutti quanti. Buona sera. I'm, I'm, I'm Calabres. Anybody here at Calabres? Those are my friends out there. They, uh, then you went from, uh, from being a Calabres to a Canadian. Uh, and, and a discount. And I'm with you. Where do you go? Where do you live in uh, I live in Sault Ste. It's about eight hours north of Toronto, Ontario. Anyone know Toronto, Ontario? Oh, come on. You're kidding? We have huge listenership up there. We really do. And what do you do on the air? What stage do you work? You know, actually, I'm, believe it or not, I'm an oldie. 93, North Satellite Radio, with the old-fashioned way. That's good, no, that's good. That's the old-fashioned There's room for everybody, right? As long as you do it properly. <laughs> Unfortunately, today, a lot of the stuff still on terrestrial on the ground are not doing it properly. We do seem to love the oldies. So, you came here, what, you heard us on the air? Yes, I did. And by the way, I was 10 years old when I came over, like a lot of these folks did from Italy. And it's nice to be in the Big Apple, and uh, we love Americans, Canadians, do, Italians, do, everybody does. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Can, I, can you play a song for me? One of my greatest performances that I've seen and I've heard, I had the pleasure of introducing this next guy right here. The Big O. You have him? Oh, we got him. Rory Orbis would love to have it. You play, of course, Rory, right? Here's a, a souvenir for Cousin Brucey. And wear that. And uh, thank you. I hope you'll have me on your air soon. I will. Uh, molto grazie. Molte grazie, molte grazie. Here's Roy Hawkins and Jones. having a good time, and I know a lot of you are trying to get through in the telephones. Uh, unfortunately, we haven't done that yet here. We're still having enough trouble getting on the air sometimes, but maybe we'll be able to do that Have you join us down here in uh, San Gennaro Feast of Little Italy in New York City, or we'll you're listening all over the wide world of music, and we're just so happy to have you with us. And may I have your name? I'm Celia from the Bronx, Park Chester. Celia from the Bronx, Park Chester. I've been coming to San Gennaro Festival for 45 years, since 1966. Well, let's see, it's 85 years old this uh, year. Chubby, oh, Chubby, Chubby. Wow, that's a bear hug. Thank you, Chubby. And 
my sister Susan's been coming here for many, many years. She lives in a box in New York and Hard Ditch. What do you like? Who do you start bringing you back to the festival? What, what is it about this place? Italian food. I love Ferraris and all the Italian food. Ferraris did a, uh, it was an anniversary not so long ago. Ferraris, I think, did the biggest cake in the world or something. Do you know anything about that? They've been here for 115 years. They've been here since 1892. Right, so they built it. A cake, I don't know how big, 150 feet or something. It was a, how, how was it? Hey, come over here, lady. Yeah, now we'll find out about this. Here's Les Schechter, who does all the PR work for this. Now, she just mentioned Ferraris, and I remember you said something. I saw a picture in the paper. Six foot cake, weighed 2,000 pounds, and it were 10,000 slices. What, what was in the cake? What did they make? Oh, they made a sponge cake and then the, whatever they put on it. It was really delicious. Well, they're, they're, their pastries are the best in the world, probably. Yep, really great. And they fed 10,000 people. Now, how did that happen? Well, it was the 85th birthday cake for the, the, the San Gennaro. And it took them two days to actually create and build. They had to build the cake. Isn't that amazing? They built the cake. They built Oh, here's the picture of it. Wow, look at that. Want to see the picture? Did you see that is gorgeous. Do you have a piece of it? No, I didn't. I didn't get a chance. To. We we're busy. We we're working. Did you eat any less? Yes, I did. It was delicious. They built it right over here, and then they were going to move it to the front of the stage. And we looked at it and said, "No, no, but you can't move it. There are probably tons, probably tons, right?" Hi, board. Carolina, Miss USA. Well, how do you? Oh, hey, this is Miss USA, everybody. Hello, oh, hello, Miss North Carolina. How do you do? Can you tell us? That you have a real, real name. My name is Michaela Lineback. And uh, now, when did this happen? When did this Pardon me, no, it's one second. Hey, did you meet Miss USA? Nice to meet you. Well, welcome, well, welcome, welcome down to uh, San Gennaro. I'm your cousin Brucey. And uh, what brings you here? I just love being here. I always got to be the Grand Marshal of the parade this afternoon, and it is fabulous. And enjoying the festival completely. You just uh, told us about a, a 20 ton cake. And let's check to what this guy ate, you know. And uh, I, I'm sorry, I really missed that. But you are. What, what is it? You know, like to be named uh, Miss USA? Like that? Well, no, I like to be named Miss Earth, uh, Miss World. That's. Now, what, what is the next one? Miss World. Miss World. Now, Miss Miss USA, I want you to be a future Miss USA. <laughs> this lady, she wait, is she beautiful? What is her name? This is Jordan. Say hello to Miss USA. Say hi. Oh, thank you. How old is she? Two and a half. And she's doing a pageant? Yes, yeah, Oh, wonderful. And how old were you when you did your first uh, pageant? Uh, I was actually 19. I wanted to do a pageant for scholarship money for my university. Did you think this would happen? I mean, the, I mean, the field was quite kind of competitive, correct? And uh, what happened when they announced, were you, what happens to your breath? I mean, your heart must be pounding. I was absolutely stunned, and I did a cartwheel, and I just shook and smiled and laughed and cried. I had about a, bil a billion emotions all at once. All at once. And it's emotions that you'll never forget as long as you live. Absolutely. So where do you go from here? So you want to go after Miss Universe, and then Miss Universe? No, what is no? I... It's world. Whatever. I don't know what the future holds. I hope so. Maybe it'll be a Miss Universe someday. Who knows? You certainly, you certainly are gorgeous and beautiful. And, and what do you do? I mean, what... But besides being beautiful and walking around so lovely, I'm sure there's some very serious things in this in this uh, person that I'm talking to. What, do you, what is it that you love to do? Well, I go to school at Columbia University. I'm a theater and economics major. So there you are. I was right. You can have so some serious parts of this. Yep, and I'm the philanthropy chair for our Greek sister at Columbia, and I'm trying to stay on the dean's list. And are you, so you are with the Grand Marshalette? of the parade. I, I was uh, a Grand Marshal about a year ago, two years ago, and that really is nice. Really is nice. Well, thank you so much for saying hello. May I? Love it. Thank you so much. Beautiful. There's a t-shirt. Send me a picture of you wearing that, would you? Oh, <laughs> I love it. Thank you. Thank you. You grab one up there. I'm not going to say no to Miss USA. You know that. Now, where are we here? I'm going to park my back here. Okay. So we're gonna play, uh, you know, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna play some beer. You like beer? Yes. You know what we do? We're down here for a very good reason, right? We're celebrating the 85th uh, Festival of San Gennaro. So why don't we take Dion, and Dion speaks uh, Italiano pretty good. The last name is uh, Demucci. Demucci. 
So what do we say? We you know the song Donna Donna. Those are with some magic of Sirius XM radio. I tell you, we can do it. Uh, throwing the switch. I hope Mike throws the right switch, and we change it to translate it to Italian. Okay. Who you want to dedicate it to? I want to dedicate it to my sister Susan. All right, Susan. Hey, Susan, this will be you.